American tradition. We love to grill, and who better than an all-American company, Blackstone, to bring us the ultimate outdoor cooking station. In fact, what you're looking at right there, not only does that food look good enough to eat, <laughs> grilling is not just an all-American tradition. It is an all-American obsession. We're going to make it so easy. We're going to give you so many options because this is the ultimate outdoor cooking station. What you're seeing right here is going to be a burner, not just a burner. We're talking talking about a powerful burner, 15,000 BTUs that is completely adjustable and actually cooked separately from this cooktop. And there you have it, the yumminess that is coming straight off that grill. Do a little dip and you Do are good dip. to go. <laughs> right over here, 18 by 24 inches of a griddle that you're able to do sandwiches, steaks on. You can put a pot on here. You can do anything you want. It won't fall through the grill. It will be perfectly cooked because you have all of your controls right here. Independent, independent, all comes together. Easy assembly on top of that takes about, are you ready for this 15 minutes to put the whole thing together? <laughs> We're gonna give you an exclusive configuration complete with right behind me, way back over there. Your carry case, because exactly. this is totally portable. And uh, a man who shows up lots of different places because he's totally <laughs> portable. Mr. Mark Gill, oh, award-winning yeah. product presenter, <laughs> truly represents some of the most popular products in the country. This happens to be one of your personal all-time favorites. Easy to understand why. <laughs> I love the design. I love the usefulness. Yep. But mostly, I love the power I'll tell of you this what. grill. Welcome to Blackstone Cooking, you guys. This is the real deal. This is anything, anytime, anywhere, and on our tailgater, it's anything, anytime, anywhere on an 18-inch slab of cold rolled steel, which cooks like cast iron, you guys. Imagine mom's and grandma's best recipes everywhere in the country you go. So guys, here's what we've got. We have a 20,000 BTU burner on this side powering our cold rolled steel. And then over here, instead of a rinky-dink little 5,000 BTU side burner that you can barely bribe to boil water, we have 15,000 BTUs. So Alice, please allow me to share a cup of coffee with you while I make you breakfast. It's, and look, the coffee is actually boiling. <laughs> of course. It's now so guys, hot. here's it's the deal. It's boiling in there. <laughs> Don't you love it? Don't you love that? So guys, over here, I'm going to use our breakfast kit, all right? You get a pancake server, which you'll see in a second, the egg rings. You get everything you need to make these terrific breakfasts. And by the way, that diner breakfast experience mm -hmm. is what Blackstone is famous for. And that surface that you're seeing me cook on, guys, this is tough as nails. You can treat this like it owes you money. Cut on it, serve on it. It doesn't matter what you do with it. You're going to get the bacon press for the perfect crisp bacon every single time. So let me go ahead and get these potatoes off here, okay? Is this actually cast iron? No. It's cold rolled seal. It performs better for this task than cast iron, but the properties are exactly the same. So let's mm -hmm. say for some reason you left this out in the weather for too long and you came back and it was just a rusty old mess. No yeah. problem. Right. It's steel. Five minutes with a pumice stone, away you go. But here's what you're going to do, you guys. You're going to go ahead, once this comes out of the box, and you're going to put a thin coat of oil on it, and you're going to let it sit. That's what's known as seasoning. That's why this egg is skating around on this cooktop like it's on ice. So let's go ahead and add some pancakes to this. And I got you, you know what? Think about the biggest pan you have at home. What's it going to do? Three, maybe four, maybe five pancakes? Well, I'll tell you what. When you let this thing go to town, you can do 10 12 dollar size pancakes. You can do some massive ones. And the bottom line is that diner experience doesn't come any better than right here. You know what that tastes like. You've oh, yeah. been to those diner places. You know what the fork feels like going through the crust on an egg. It better because you're cooking it outside. And there's exactly. something about food that is cooked outside. You're right. It tastes better. It's flavored differently. And the experience you're going to have is like that diner style cooking, which frankly, more and more, even in homes Ooh. nowadays, people want this style because you can cook so much more on it. Exactly. It cooks better. But I want to talk about the power. Yep. Because when we talk about 20,000 BTUs, what does that really mean to me? <laughs> I don't huge. really know. Because, you know, I hear BTUs right. usually with an air conditioning Think about unit it. or something for the house. 20,000 BTUs? A 12,000 BTU air conditioner is powerful enough to cool a 700 square foot area. So I have 20,000 BTU heating up an 18 by 14 inch area. 
You do the math. Yeah. You want power? That's power. <laughs> that is power. And that surface space, I think it's what, 18 by 24 18 inches? 18 by 14 on okay. the griddle side. Oh, 18 by 14. Right, okay. and then you've got that powerful side burner. Right. Oh, you know what? That was a mistake. Never, ever, ever put the pretty pancake or the ugly pancake on top. Always okay. bury that. Just, and you, that you, way. I was just going to say, you can just give the ugly <laughs> pancake give that a to flip. the show host. Because well, we've got a fork for you right there, my friend. So Absolutely. let me go ahead and do that. And let me go ahead and do that. Good Guys, job. whether it's uh, uh, breakfast on Sunday, whether you're tailgating, whether you've got that great experience, mm -hmm. you want to share breakfast and brunch with people, this is definitely the way to do it. Perfect results every single time mm. on a machine. Like I said, you can use anywhere, anytime to cook anything. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> I love it. Mm. That's it. I like that move. I'm telling you, <laughs> food tastes different Don't when you, you love cook it, it up. Cook outside, but look at the way this is designed. Do you know the dimensions of it, like the width of it by any chance? I can get that, but... Um Oh, uh, offhand, uh, yeah, again, the uh, the width here is you've got 18 and 18, so you've got about 37 about 36, inches wide. Yeah, all right. And you're looking at about the same height, which is adjustable. We're going to talk a lot more about those legs in just a second. So let me go ahead and make a couple of little piles here, okay? Listen, we took a whole crew across the country, and we stopped in some of the most famous food places that you can think of. And one of the places we stopped was on South Street in Philly. I know. Hold a guy out that's uh -huh. been working at the cheesesteak place for 18 years. I know years. exactly where you were. Right? You saw it. <laughs> yes, you I saw do. it. Listen, we pulled him out on the sidewalk and we were like, listen, man, how do we measure up? How do we compare? Is this the authentic Philly cheesesteak experience? And he said, it's the same. So here's what we're going to do, you guys. Mm -hmm. Great little guy to add to your order here. This lid is what you need for melted cheese, finishing basted eggs, all that kind of stuff. So here's what we're going to do, Alice. Because I have this side burner, wow. I'm able to do some dishes that I can't do anywhere else. There's a famous hot dog place in Chicago. All right. They just opened up one in Tampa. Uh, they've got one in a few places, but Chicago's known for it. It's right on the outskirts of downtown. Okay. And here's their most famous sandwich. And the reason I do this, guys, however it is you like to travel the country, bus, plane, boat, car, doesn't matter. A lot of us like to do it from the comfort of our TV with our remote, all the cooking channels. And mm -hmm. we check out all of this great food from all over the country. Well, I'll tell you what, you think that sandwich is done? Watch this. Take the whole thing. You're not gonna make a cup of au jus. What are you You're doing? You're gonna dip <laughs> the whole sandwich, bring it up here, and then let's grab a little bit of color and good for you. And there's one of the most famous wow. sandwiches you'll ever find in Chicago. And you remember we now, talked about now this? Now I guess I know why they call it the French dip. There it is. <laughs> I right? never knew that before. I'm French and I dipped it. <laughs> <laughs> You, that was a, that may have qualified as a dunk. That was a full-on dunk. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. Look and if you've that. ever heard of cheesesteaks and they ask you if you want it wit or without, yeah. that usually means wit or without uh, uh, cheese whiz. So yeah. I'll tell you what. <laughs> why do I have to choose? Are you kidding? How about some cheese whiz and oh. provolone? Oh, my God. Now, the best cheesesteak in the world isn't in Philly. It's at your house. It's Look in that. your hand. It's Look at where that, you it guys. is. It is right Isn't in your pretty? hand. Oh, oh yeah, man. I'm going right there because I love Philly cheesesteaks. There's nothing like it. But look at the way you're able to cook with this. I want you to also think about think about even in those fabulous, fabulous uh, Japanese steakhouses. Oh, we've got some onions coming up for you. What do they cook on? This is the type of surface. But you have it now in your home, but you have the power that you've never been able to get before. Right. And I love that it has a, a drip tray over here. So yep. if you want to get rid of that um, fat and everything that's cooking, exactly. it goes right over into and here. And that's the way you clean it, it as well. Uh, oh. All you do is take a little bit of water wow. and you're going to let it steam and mm -hmm. then you scrape it off. So guys, here's what we're going to do. Wow. Just to show you some of the incredible dishes we're going to make, I'm actually going to put together a chicken marsala. You're going to love this. Okay. Love it, love it, love it. But you're going to love what you're going to get home. There we go. Uh, by the way, I do highly recommend that spatula, mm -hmm. that metal spatula. Oh, yeah. That's part of our accessory kit. But, you mean the one that's on the ground? But this, <laughs> mm -hmm. but this is what you're going to get. You're going to get this whole thing. What a great design, right? Because what you're going to get when you get this home is about a 15-minute assembly. We're actually going to kind of show you. Absolutely, you we will. About 15 minutes. You know those other grills that you get? The big, bulky ones that certainly are not portable. This is completely portable. And you can put it together so fast, you can't believe it. Over here, look at this huge burner. Look at the size of the burner you're getting here. 15,000 BTUs. Go Google any grill you want to and right. see what kind of power you're going to get with it. And All look right. at the price of this. 
I mean, it's an absolutely incredible. Even if you had a big, big, huge grill, gas grill, which I don't know why you would ever use that again after this. Think of the portability of this. Look at that price point. You can spend you can spend a thousand, oh, can two you ever? thousand dollars on ever? a traditional grill and not even get a side burner on it. You're getting this <laughs> huge burner here. You're getting this huge griddle space yep. that you can do anything from steaks. Nothing's gonna fall through it. No ma'am. And so simple and exclusive configuration yep. because the case comes with it. Why do you get a case? Because you can take it absolutely well, it's a anywhere you want to exactly. go. Exactly. We want you, you know, to go anywhere. They say tailgating. Sometimes I just want to take it on vacation with me. Right. Whether it's camping, whether you've got a Well, we a keep boat. it on our RV. We you love could, it. Literally, you could take this on your boat, and then wherever you dock, right. just take it out to a little park and set it up. Are you kidding me? Well, let's me? talk setup for a second, okay? Okay. Because here's how most grill setups go. Three hours, pack of Band-Aids, a lot of swearing. Family doesn't want to talk to you. You don't even want to grill when you're done with it, okay? <laughs> swearing. Here's how this is going to go down. This grill plate is going to come in a separate wrap. That's just to keep it protected. You're going to take it out of the wrap and put it on here. There's only one way to do it. it takes you less than 30 seconds. Okay. Your grease trap clips into place, 10 seconds. Okay. Now you've got two buttons. Pop that on, pop that on, and put a battery right there for your ignition. Guys? you're done. Now, when it comes to the legs and the setup, you have four legs. Each one of them are individually adjustable. So if you have a different oh. terrain, you can always level out your grill. And as far as setups go, guys, watch this. It's going to come folded. Here comes your assembly. Eat. <laughs> <laughs> We're done. That's it. <laughs> Doesn't Don't get you love easier it? than that. And let me tell you what, the value you're getting on this, because this is an exclusive configuration where we are including that, that um, carry case to go with it. Chicken marsala cooked yep. outside. You're keeping all of the heat out of your house. And the odors. And the odors. And that, the odors. That get, I mean, cooked fish inside. How long does that stay, stay with you inside? But it tastes better cooked outside. Take the exactly. whole thing outside because you have even better than your traditional stove top. You now have a cooking service that really mimics the pros. This is like a professional cooking. This is a professional kitchen. Guys, you are traveling everywhere you go now. Football game, baseball game, the mm -hmm. college parties. You're going everywhere with a complete cooking station, a complete kitchen. So watch what we're going to do here and watch how simple and easy this is. And by the way, Alice, just so you know, Kelly Diedring was kind enough to lend us a few of her spray-on herbs. I'm going to finish this off with a little bit of garlic when we're done. So watch what I'm going to do here, okay? I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take my nice big bowl and my pot. Imagine being able to do pasta, pasta on outside. the road, you guys. I wow. love it. So here we go. Let's get this out of here. By the way, marsala, while pricey in the restaurant, mm -hmm. is very simple to make. It really is. All you need, a little bit of pasta, a couple of pounded out chicken breasts, and a marsala sauce that you can either make with some capers and white wine, or go ahead and just buy it. Life couldn't be easier. A couple of pieces of chicken there. Let's grab one of our spatulas, which I can't say enough times, comes in the coolest accessory pack ever for your Blackstone. But so see, let's go when ahead. When you're using a griddle like that, even with my mushrooms, if I wanted to flavor them with a little bit of marsala wine, yep. I could put it right on the griddle. Exactly. You can't do that on any grill out there, but you can do it on your Blackstone. And now follow me over here, and we're going to finish this dish off. Honey, I will follow you anyway. <laughs> Guys, this is easy. It's simple. Everybody can do this. There's nothing special about what's going on here at all. So let's go ahead, give this a little bit of green. Now, here's where I'm going to make it really special, you guys. Our friend Kelly Diedring mm -hmm. talks about Simply Beyond spray-on herbs every time she gets a chance. And these are very cool because this is not garlic flavor. It's garlic. Here's the ingredients in here. There's two. Garlic, fresh squeeze, and a little bit of canola oil to help with the delivery. There's a burlap sack on the inside of this can, so the aerosol never gets to the product to degrade it. There is compressed air around the bag. It gives it a squeeze, and watch this. Boom, boom, boom. That's like I squeeze fresh garlic right on top of it. So here is what I'm going to do once and I a, get a fork by the for way, you. About half of our quantity in that is gone. I will All tell right. you, I can smell it. It here smells we go. amazing. I'm going to make you. And your hands don't smell like garlic. Garlic exactly. For the next, uh, I'm going to make okay. you what we call around my house the perfect bite. All right. It's the sampling of everything on the plate. So I got a little bit of chicken. I got a little bit of mushrooms. Yeah. And you, my Italian friend, I have a little bit of pasta, and I would never hand it to you unless I knew it was going to be right. All right. This Here we be, go. This should be uh, really. I love it. Love it, love uh -huh. it. Mm. Isn't that nice? The garlic, the chicken, and every time we cook on that flat top, it leaves our signature, and that gets better and better and better. <laughs>
how'd we do? I'm not worthy. I love it. I'm not worthy. I love that it. I love so it. so good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's to be fantastic, able to Alice. do all of these different things, all of them outside in a portable manner, whether it's um, whether it's making pasta sauce, right? Whether you're throwing your your sausage, peppers, and onions outside, having a griddle changes everything. But having a burner right next to it, so that then you can put your pots on there, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Now we do have, if you want, a traditional grill. We're going to talk about you that right have that. away for sure. So I'll tell you what here. Let's talk about traveling around that country again. Let's do it. Hot dogs. How about a Chicago dog, which I'm sure I did wrong because I'm at a celery salt. We got a chili cheese dog. And then you know what? If you just love it plain, a little bit of sauerkraut and some mustard and Alice, that is summertime. Speaking of summer, let's head on over here. Let me show you the coolest add-on I have ever seen for a barbecue ever, 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 anywhere. Ever. Look at this, you guys. This is our grill box. Here's what this does. This fits over the burner and turns that side into a 15,000 BTU, hits 800 degrees and beyond burner. So here's what we're gonna do here, guys. Let's go ahead, and get our sausages what? out of the way. The grill box is so affordable. If you wanna oh. add that grill box in, I think it's what, 69.95? Something like, yeah, 69. Yeah. Perfect. So let's you go just, ahead. Do you just clip that on? You just set it right it's on top It's just a there? clip on. That's all it is. There's a couple of little guys that holds it in place, and you're all done. So, guys, here is summer. Here's every barbecue, every cookout, every tailgating experience, from kebabs to steaks to chicken to pork to the best burgers from the Pure Land Meat Company and the most unbelievable center-cut sirloin steaks that you've ever seen. Now, I'm going to be talking about the burgers in just a minute. We're going to talk about the sirloin steaks a little bit later today. But between the flat top... And the add-on grill box, holy moly. You want to talk about eating good in the summertime, man. Right. Blackstone's got you covered more ways than you can even imagine. And by the way, we have those burgers coming up, the debut. So uh, if you can, stick around for that. If You, you might want to pre-order them. We're very, very limited with that, as we are with the grill today. There Don't miss out on this. Look at what you're able to do. Listen to That's the so sizzle. Pretty. I have tried to cook these peppers on a traditional grill forever. They, as soon as they, they break down, they fall right through. That's all they do. You That's never have to do. worry about that ever again. Isn't that the best? Look at, the, look at all of the ways you're going to be able to use this. And the way that you control that that uh, heat temperature yep. is um, it's it just smooth. It's just a smooth knob, a, low to high. It's not yep. low, medium, high. You don't have to worry Ooh. about a big flame coming up and, exactly. and charring one part ow. and uh, not cooking the other part. Ow! Yeah. Bread gets ow hot. Did it get you? <laughs> Look at this, you guys. The perfect garlic bread. That toast wow. is amazing. I'm gonna walk this over here, Alice. Look at the way it's evenly cooked. Look at right? the, look at the caramelization on that. So I'm gonna pop that one there. We're gonna pop yeah. that one there. Okay. So listen. I've always, I've always said, and I always like to say, no matter how good dinner is on a Sunday night, mm -hmm. by Thursday, you're over it. Guys, when you cook this kind of stuff inside, the smell of the fish, the smell of the veggies, the smell of the lemons, where does it go? Your curtains, your cupboards, and your floors. And it stays there. Guys, take these recipes outside. You'll never throw your husband out of the kitchen again. And watch this. You want to talk about a perfectly seasoned grill. How about that flesh side down, and how about that skin side down, guys. The skin is barely sticking to the fish, but it's not sticking to the cold rolled steel, well-seasoned pan. And before I move off of this and show you my little surprise in the pot here, That's a big I just pot. woke Alice up. Yeah, Look at you this. Did. Every single time you wow. make fish, I don't care what it is, do yourself a favor and get those lemons on there. You see that caramelized lemon juice? That's a taste experience like you've never had, guys, yeah. and I promise you that. If you take anything out of this show as far as tips, every time you cook fish, get that lemon on there. So let's let that hang out for a second and join me here because this is the culmination of everything that tailgater's about. Anything, anytime, anywhere on a rock sturdy piece of equipment that's even gonna hold up under a 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 pound seafood and oh. clam bake. Good. Are you kidding? Can you do me a favor? Could you grab me a red glove from over there so I can sure. pour this out with any third degree burns. <laughs> 
Red, Even a towel. Glove. Guys, have a look at this. Red glove, this is so red. simple. It's so easy. It's so fast. All you need to do is fill this up with anything you want. Crab, caw hogs, lobsters, mussels, and you just go ahead and let her steam, boy. Oh, boy. And have a look at the result. The perfect seafood and clam bake. Now, my whole family is from PEI and Eastern Canada. And I'll tell you, we line up for this. And it takes so much time and so much effort and so much specific equipment. But with the tailgater, that's all we need. So let's go ahead, grab our salmon, and let me show you the best looking seafood feast you've ever laid your eyes on from a machine that you can literally take anywhere you go, anywhere in the country, you guys. And this I is Blackstone cooking. I bet that you spent more on the food that is on that yes, plate than you did on this grill. Yes, this ma'am. This grill griddle is amazing from Blackstone. $139.95. You think of what you spend on those other grills that are just big, static, huge behemoths <laughs> that don't go anywhere and don't have the kind of power you get here. Getting exactly. Here. They use a flame that you can't really control as easily as you can here. That's why places that, that really utilize like your Japanese steakhouse, it's why they want a flat cooking griddle like that because it cooks better. You exactly. can control the heat and the surface space to have the burner next to it. And uh, what kind of um, pots can I use on that burner? Anything. Anything you want. Anything? Any pot you would all use right. in your kitchen, you're going to use in that burner. So guys, have a look at this. This is what it's all about. Yeah. Look at the crust on that pork. Look at the start on this chicken and look at the char on these peppers. Guys, if you love summer cooking, grilling, if you love getting the people together, if you love showing love through food, this yeah. is the way to do it. And if you really love them, Alice, follow me here, okay? We're talking about Mexican street corn. We're talking about shrimp tacos. We're talking about that great onion tapenaki. Is that a word? Uh, it is now. <laughs> that it's we a, talked it's about. It's a margillism. <laughs> That's right. I'm just making stuff up as I go. Guys, oh, have a good is. time with this. The volcano. <laughs> There's your volcano, guys. <laughs> Remember what I said? Treat it like it owes you money and come on over here. Do you know how much those, those Japanese dinners are? Oh, when you go out to those places, there's a reason you go, only go on birthdays, right? <laughs> It's too expensive to go every other day. Isn't that the truth? And you know what? Just for fun, yeah. let's give you every single experience you've had <laughs> at every exhibition, summer fair, wow. good time festival. By the way, you guys, if you've ever been to one of those festivals or fairs, I want you to start looking around because you're going to find Blackstone everywhere. I'm telling you right now, you guys. And this is, an, this is a company based in the United States. It's engineered. It is developed yep. all right here. It's Exactly. In the U.S. as it should be, because you know what? This is all American food. This is all American yes, grilling made by an all American company that's going to make it simple, easy, and crazy affordable for you today. Now, do you see what's happening? Do you see what we're doing? Yeah. We're taking that funnel cake. Did there's the donut the on the bottom. There? There's the watermelon. There's another piece of donut. There's the grilled pineapple. Here's the top part of our unbelievable dessert here. And you know what? Just for fun, before we finish it out, guys, please remember this is Blackstone. This is HS. Yeah. This is summer cooking at its finest. Please, please, please oh, do what I do. Get your friends together. Get your family together and show a little love through food and let them take a little love through food. Because, guys, this is what we're talking about when we talk about food, family, fun, get together, summer. This is Blackstone cooking, and I need you to be a part of it, you oh, guys. I, I can't believe you actually added added fruit to a funnel cake. Because oh, now no, we're keeping it down. I can totally justify that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get my fruit servings I in love it. with my funnel cake. Unbelievable. Isn't that fun? It's right here, guys. A 15-minute assembly. You get this home on, what, five flex payments less than exactly. $28.